No. They should go to prison. This isn't talked about enough. When men are falsely accused, their lives are often ruined. Even when they're proven innocent. Their reputation with their family and friends is quickly destroyed because everyone thinks that they're that type of guy. The cost of defending themselves. The time it takes them away from work. Potentially jail time. It doesn't take a lot of proof to get someone arrested for something like this. Not only do I know people who have been falsely accused and have been penalized for it, I also majored in criminal justice. I mean, why do you think I majored in criminal justice? It doesn't even hurt just the man that was accused. It rips families apart. This affects me on a very personal level. And it's horrendous. Women that do stuff like this are truly evil. Obviously we have to be careful with this. The man would have to be able to prove that she falsely accused him for sure. And if he has enough proof to back it up, I think she should be arrested and put in prison. For as long as he would have gotten if he were to have done the crime. This is not something we can play around with. Men's lives are taken away because of this. And according to online sources, less than 1% are false accusations, which I don't buy that at all. We aren't taught our Miranda rights in school. And during the interrogation process, law enforcement can use some pretty intense tricks to get you to admit to things that you probably didn't do or to twist your words against you. And a man who has never committed a crime and has never been in this situation, especially the younger ones, may not understand what he's up against and may not know that he has the right to request an attorney. It's extremely vague and confusing. 